here we are africa's largest shopping mall here in casablanca let's go and discover what's inside yeah so we're so excited to be here at the shopping mall and it's not something that me and gogo do a lot of shopping do we no we don't do shopping mall we go to shopping mall for the cool down yeah <laughs> Cooling down in the shopping mall and also Gogo likes to see what things he can get to eat. Freebies. <laughs> it's very clean. And the air conditioning is wonderful, not too cold for me. It is absolutely perfect air conditioning and yeah. lots of shops in here as lots well. Lots of amazing shops. Yeah. So far we've came across lots of shops. Gogo, -go, what do you think of the shop? Looks so delicious. The shopping mall is about 15 minutes taxi ride from the city centre and uh, built on the seafront. We are just outside of the shopping mall now. There is a huge lake in here and you can have this sea breeze coming to you because the sea is just behind this mm. uh, bushes. We can hear the waves as well hitting us. Can you hear them? Yeah, and the, it's beautiful. Like beautiful breeze coming from the sea as well. We've also asked about the water fountains because we can see there's water fountains here. But the security guard has told us they're not on today. So I don't know if there's special times that they have their water fountains on. But all together, what you find in you're enjoying about the shopping The shopping mall, mall the aquarium is absolutely huge and first time ever in my life i seen a huge aquarium like that and the shark and the fish with the wings the fish the stingray i think it's called the fish with the wings it's got wings <laughs> it's got wings go go it's what got is it called wings. sting rain it stings you oh yeah it stings you that looks so cute yeah and huge as well so the aquarium is very, very beautiful in there. Um, we do have an issue with shopping malls when we film because a lot of them play music. And I think if you've been following us for quite some time, you'll know that for copyright reasons, we can't have music on our videos. So we'll show you as much as we can, but let's go and see what's going on with the food in the shopping mall. Ooh, let's go to third floor. Wow, there's a huge supermarket inside here as well called Marjane. This huge shopping mall uh, built in 2011, it's finished in 2011, started in 2010, and it cost $200 million. And it's as big as 590,000 square meter. Wow, it's huge. And so well kept. The shops are wonderful, but guess what? They've even got an adventure playground. That's a real ice skate ring. You can really feel the cold as yeah. well. Look at the steam balls up yeah. as well from the ice. Amazing. Cool, go go. Now I'm gonna go for basketball. Basketball. Yeah. There really is all kinds of shops, like lots of different chain shops. There's lots to do for children. There's lots to do for people that are shopping. We can smell the food. We're on our way up. Yeah. Let's see if we can get some yummy go-go. So there's escalators. Oh, go-go. What? That's how you start your diet. Yeah. Before your food. This is, this is the workout. So this one's not working. This is a bit of a workout for you to get your reward at the top. All the other escalators are working, but not the food one. Not the food one, always. Oh, can you manage? I am Can dying. you manage, Gogo? 
So there's lots of Western foods in here. But guess what we found? We found IKEA. And we love IKEA food because it's so cheap. And as you know, we do cheap. So we've came along to get the five dirham ice cream, but they've run out. So what you get in Gogo? They run out of ice cream, so instead of ice cream, we're getting hot dog. Hot dog? Yeah. This Ooh. is the closest thing to ice cream, isn't it? Yeah. But yeah, so you can get a hot dog, 10 dirham for a hot dog. Wow! Look at that machine. Yeah. Squeezes all the oranges. Yeah, it's got oranges Amazing. in there, yeah. And you can sit anywhere, so we're going to see if we can get a seat outside. The guys told us we can sit anywhere. A lot of these food places look as though they're closed. We don't know if they're closed because they're no longer operating or we don't know if they're closed because we've came quite early. You can even come in Ikea and relax on one of the sofas or one of the beds whilst you're having a shop. We've got Baskin Robbins. So you've got all of the Western food chains. So many. Gogo, what have you got? Hot dog. Why have you got all these sauces? All I asked was mayonnaise and he gave me all this. Wow. Yeah. That's amazing. I don't really like mustard. But I'm going to chance it because I think mustard is good with hot dog. Yeah, must. You have to have oh. mustard with a hot dog. By the way, we are in Morocco. I am Muslim, alhamdulillah. In Morocco, you can't find pork and these hot dogs made from beef. So we are having beef hot dogs today. Beef or chicken? Beef. It was saying before that I asked the gentleman. Put the mustard down. Are you putting ketchup as well? Oh yeah. I like this ketchup, it just comes off. Yeah, normally you have trouble yeah, opening with them. them. Oh, it's up here. Mm. And just to tell you, in case you missed it, 10 dirham. 10 dirham for this hot dog. Is that a good price, Gogo? It is a perfect price. And we went for the cheapest thing because we do things on a budget and we want to show you that not all traveling has to be expensive. And mayonnaise. Gogo is really a connoisseur of hot dogs. Now it's something we don't eat often, is it? No, we normally go for the healthy or mainly the street food, the local street food. Local street food only. I like the mustard, but it's so delicious. This is so good. Hot dog, you won me over with your cheapest option in this mall. Is yours because we, you said we're gonna go for ice cream. The ice cream man is not working. I never had a hot dog in a shopping mall before, especially by the looking at the North Atlantic Ocean. But like by the side of the ocean, the shopping mall is absolutely beautiful must come and see if you ever come to casablanca how beautiful is this this is where gogo wants to take me shopping everyone are we going in the pandy 
We're going in the Fendi. Effendi? You taking me shopping there? You go in, I'm coming. I've got to go to the toilet. You um, go in, I'm coming, yeah? But race. He always has a phobia. Look at him. He has a phobia of using that wallet of his, everyone. We definitely could have filmed more for you in there had there not been so much music playing. But there's lots of fun and games going on there as well, isn't there? It is, there? yeah, so... But there's a whole area outside here that you can sit, you can have some food, you can have a nice drink. Go, go. Guess what? They have Wi-Fi. They've got Wi-Fi in the shopping mall. Did you not put your Wi-Fi on? No, I never knew that. Why don't you see if it works? Boom, boom, boom. You might have to step inside. Or you might get a signal outside. Let's check. No, you don't get a signal outside. You just walk inside and get a signal, I think. Yeah, let's check. Let's, just... let's check if Africa's largest shopping mall has free Wi-Fi. Guess what? You can get free Wi-Fi in here, just in case you don't have a phone uh, who has got internet already. You can actually search wherever you want, whatever you want. Well, I am Turkish and I believe we make the best coffee in the world. Turkish coffee for me is number one. But when people visit Morocco, they intend going for Moroccan tea, like mint tea. And it's very famous, very popular, but they miss out this delicious coffee it's very very famous in Morocco as well uh, I believe Moroccan coffee for us now took over tea we discovered it last time we were here by the side of the road if you haven't seen the video check it out on our first Moroccan episodes we have found this lovely coffee vendor on the by the side of the road when we we're driving from A to B and he was selling coffee it was so delicious and since then we became addicted to Moroccan coffee and it always comes. You can find the coffee houses everywhere in Morocco and it always comes with a bottle of water. Moroccan coffee, fragrant dark coffee and warm spices. I'm gonna taste it for you all lovely people. It is so good, so strong. I drank coffee everywhere we visited. After Turkey, best place. Something I love to drink when we're here in Morocco is the iced tea. And quite often you can get it peach or you can get it lemon. I've gone for lemon and look at that stick of mint. It smells amazing and it's served really, really nice and not expensive, we'll put the prices up for you. Sitting here drinking an iced tea, but something quite interesting is that plastic straws. So a lot of countries, plastic straws is banned. So it's quite unusual to see that nowadays. However, plastic straws here in Morocco, let's give it a taste. That is really, really good iced lemon tea. It's not too sweet because I don't like the ones that are too sweet, but it's perfectly lemony. The lemon, you can smell it. And that mint, I'm going to put push that mint right the way down. Is that, Delicious. Uh, we grow the Moroccan mint in our garden as well. Yeah, so in England, we bought a Moroccan mint plant and it's overtook in our garden but it's amazing because you only need one leaf when you're making the tea and it's so strong compared to the, the mint that we get back in the UK. We love Moroccan mint. We were gonna take you for a walk around the lake and show you the sea, but they blew the whistle at us. The whistle, the whistle, the whistle. You're not allowed to walk around the park. We can't understand that because there's a path all the way around. 
But if you go near the lake, they'll blow the whistle at you. Maybe it's for safety, go go. No, they think you're going to go swimming. I think uh, there is some work going on down there. I'm just trying to be on their side, but I don't see anything. Maybe they think I'm going to go for swimming. They do. They think he's going to go swimming and try and eat the fish. Yeah. And just like that, our time in Africa's largest shopping mall is over. And we are making our way back to the center of Casablanca in a taxi, which is so easy to pick up outside the mall. Also buses run here as well. Have you enjoyed it, Gogo? I absolutely enjoy my time in this biggest shopping mall in Africa, here in Casablanca. Don't forget, give us a like, a comment and a subscribe. And let us know, have you been to this shopping mall? If you're from Morocco or if you came to visit Morocco. And please don't forget to follow our journey as we make our way around Morocco. We've got more coming up from Casablanca and so much more adventures here in Morocco. And bye from us, from Casablanca. See you soon!